How safe do you think Africa is? This question elicit varied responses depending on who you ask. Some might visualize the continent's vibrant cultures and awe-inspiring landscapes, while others might associate it with civil unrest or crime headlines. But what is the true picture? Is Africa a continent plagued with peril, or is it a victim of skewed perceptions? To answer this, we turn to recent data on murders and shootings. Let's scrutinize the reality of safety in Africa, starting with the 10 most dangerous countries, Somalia, Sudan, Democratic Republic of Congo, Central African Republic, Libya, South Sudan, Nigeria, Burundi, Egypt, and Ethiopia. Our in-depth exploration begins with the 10th most dangerous country. Somalia takes the 10th spot on our list, a fact that might catch you off guard. Known for its breathtaking landscapes and rich cultural diversity, this country also faces grave safety issues. The recent data on murders and shootings has flagged Somalia as the 10th most dangerous country country in Africa. This high-risk status stems from complex and unique circumstances. Critical factors such as political instability, socioeconomic inequities, and organized crime significantly shape Somalia's perilous landscape. The past year has witnessed a disturbing surge in violent incidents, especially murders and shootings, painting a grim picture of reality. The last 12 months have shown a marked upsurge in the number of recorded incidents. This trend is not only alarming for local authorities, but has also caught the attention of the international community. It's important to note, however, that like every country, Somalia too has its challenges. While danger is more prevalent in some regions, there are also parts where life carries on relatively undisturbed. Up next, we'll be exploring the ninth most dangerous country in Africa. Ranking at number nine is Libya. This nation, despite its rich culture and history, grapples with a high crime rate. This strikingly beautiful land with its breathtaking landscapes and lively cities is unfortunately tainted by a high incidence of violence. The reasons for its perilous status are varied. High poverty levels, political instability, and ineffective law enforcement contribute to an environment where crime runs rampant. The people of Libya face daily threats of assault, robbery, and in more severe cases, even murder. This country's ranking is not a testament to the character or cultural wealth of its people, but rather the systemic challenges it faces. It serves as a stark reminder that safety is a complex issue, deeply intertwined with socioeconomic factors that often go unnoticed by the casual onlooker. Stay tuned as we unveil the eighth most dangerous country in Africa. Coming in next on our list of Africa's most hazardous places is none other than South Sudan. The factors contributing to this alarming status are multifaceted. South Sudan is plagued by a relentless civil war, causing not just a spike in homicide rates, but also leading countless citizens to abandon their homes. Moreover, the country's law enforcement bodies are struggling to maintain order, resulting in a rise crime rates. The lack of a strong collective government, coupled with the rampant ownership of small arms among the populace, only exacerbates the conditions leading to a staggering number of shootings on a regular basis. The economic instability and deficiency in the region further fuels the cycle of violence, making South Sudan an unstable place to live in or lower. It's a tragic reality that the beauty of South Sudan's landscapes and the resilience of its people are overshadowed by the dangers lurking within its borders. And now, the revelation you've all been waiting for. The most dangerous country in Africa is crowned as the most dangerous country in Africa, the Central African Republic. This country has earned this dubious distinction due to a series of unfortunate factors. The incidence of murder and shooting is staggeringly high, making it hold the record for the highest crime rate in the continent. However, it's not purely about statistics. The underlying causes reveal a society wrestling with profound issues. Widespread poverty and inequality prevail in the Central African Republic, fostering an environment conducive to criminal activities. A dearth of quality education and job opportunities sparks desperation, compelling many to resort to violent means to survive. The justice system in the Central African Republic is floundering, with a high number of cases remaining unresolved, breeding a culture of bav. Moreover, various armed conflicts have thrown the region into turmoil, contributing significantly to the overall insecurity. 
These conflicts have not just escalated violent crimes but have also displaced innumerable people, intensifying the crisis. This intricate weave of socio-economic and political issues has fostered a hostile environment where safety becomes a luxury that many in the Central African Republic cannot afford. And thus, we present present to you the Central African Republic, the most dangerous country in Africa. In conclusion, let's revisit the names of the 10 most dangerous countries in Africa, based on recent crime and violence data. Somalia, Democratic Republic of Congo, South Sudan, Central African Republic, Sudan, Libya, Mali, Nigeria, Burundi, and Eritrea. Despite the adversities, these nations continue to hold potential and resilient communities showing the unyielding spirit of humanity. Let's not forget, Africa's beauty extends far beyond what is immediately visible. Remain vigilant, always inquisitive, and keep exploring.